everybody, so I did a bit of thrift store shopping recently and I actually got enough for at least two videos just from one thrift store. So I decided to break it up and I'm going to do part of the haul um, in this video and then I'll make another video for the rest of it. But let's go ahead and look at some of the things I got. Um, this first little bag I got for 49 cents and the main thing I saw in this that I wanted was the uh, spot dog from the Rugrats. So let's go ahead and open it and take a look at what's inside. So first we have a little water gun and uh, that's not too exciting to me. That I'll probably put in the uh, giveaway box. I'll clean it off first because it looks like it's got dust and stuff on it. But it does look like it's, you know, in good shape, good little water gun. So I'll probably put that in the giveaway box to give away some time. And then we have... Uh, let's see, this is a Pirates of the Caribbean. I think these were Happy Meal toys. And I'm trying to, yeah, it's like a periscope. Like you open it like that and you can look out through it like to magnify things or, yeah. So that's kind of what it does. And I remember I actually got one of these when they had these at McDonald's, which was quite a few years ago, I think. And so that's pretty cool that I found another one of these. And this will probably go in a giveaway too. It's probably not something I'll keep. So if you're a Pirates of the Caribbean fan, uh, make sure you enter the giveaways because this will probably be going in there. And then the thing that I actually wanted from this bag, which was the Spot Dog from Rugrats. And he's in really pretty good shape considering. I mean, he's probably quite a few years old, 1997, so almost 20 years. And... That sounds so incredible to say 1997 was almost 20 years ago, but it's true. So, he's cute. I always loved Rugrats. Uh, I have fond memories of all the Nickelodeon shows growing up, so that's pretty awesome. I like that. And then let's go ahead and we'll open the middle bag. And the main reason I bought this bag was because I saw this little bunny, and there's also like a little bear. And they look like Build-A-Bear type stuff. I'm not sure if that's what they actually are, but I thought they were really cute, so I wanted that. So that's the main reason I got this bag, which was 69 cents. So let's go ahead and open it. And, ah, see what's inside, if I can get it to open. There we go. Let's see, the first thing, it looks like there's like a watch. Or, no, it's not a watch, it's a compass. So I guess you just wear it on your wrist and it's a little compass. So that'll probably go in the giveaway box. And then let's see, we got a little uh, little people car. So this is just a little people road racer car, I guess. And it's 2009. And that'll probably go in the giveaway box too, because I don't normally keep uh, these kind of things. I keep little people some of the figures, but I don't really keep like the vehicles and stuff. And then we have low keychain. Uh, this is a Barbie keychain. Cool little uh, sunglasses that kind of uh, change design. And I'm not sure if this was a McDonald's thing or... Yeah, I think it was. I think it was probably made for McDonald's, but that's cute. That'll probably go in the giveaway thing too. And then uh, just an empty like shopping box. I'm not sure if that's a Barbie or what that is, but a little shopping bag. And then Dream Bride. Uh, looks again like a little Barbie-like thing or maybe even a generic kind of Barbie-like thing. And then we have uh, part of a broken heart, I think. So I'll probably toss that because I don't think that's in good shape. And we have like a little plastic spider little novelty like thing so I'll put those to the side and then we have I know I've seen this dinosaur from somewhere I was trying to think where this dinosaur is from if you guys know where this dinosaur is from let me know because I know I know this dinosaur I was trying to think was this for, is this from Doc McStuffins I know there's a dinosaur on yeah, that, I'm not sure, I, but he looks so familiar. I know I've seen him in something, so if you guys know for sure where this dinosaur is from, let me know. And that, I'm not sure if I'll keep or give away. I could go either way with that. And then these I'll probably keep, because that's the main reason I bought the thing, and it's the little bunny and the little bear. And they do look like, to me, like Build-A-Bear type stuff, but I don't see 
written on them anything. If you guys know if these are in fact Build-A-Bear or if they're some other kind of uh, toy, let me know because I'd definitely like to know. But I love the purple bunny and the white bear is cute too. So I'll probably definitely be keeping those. And then last bag of toys that I'm going to do today is a 49 cent bag. And mainly I just got this because it had a lot of Polly Pocket type stuff in it. And the dolls look like they're in good shape. I don't know if the clothes are, so I don't know if I'll keep all these or not. But I figured, hey, for 49 cents, it will be fun to go through. So let's go ahead and open them. See if any of this stuff is in really good shape. Let's see. We have, this is, uh, is that Aurora? It's definitely one of the Disney princesses. I, I was thinking it looked like Sleeping Beauty. The dress is in horrible shape, so that's no good. Um, I don't know if I'll keep that. The doll is in pretty good shape, so I don't know. That may go in a giveaway or it may not, but I don't know. I probably will toss the dress away because that's just not in good shape at all. Maybe I can find another dress to put on her because I do have stuff like that. And then, let's see, we have... Oh, this looks like Cinderella. So I guess uh, these are a lot of princess dolls. And this jacket is in really bad shape. So I'm just going to take that off. The skirt looks lo like it's in okay shape. But she can just wear the little white shirt <laughs> and the yellow skirt. So uh, she might end up either being kept or put in a giveaway. I'm not sure. But she's cute. And like I said, I might have to look and see if I have additional clothes that are in better shape. Here's one that the outfit is in good shape. This is another, um, I think this is Aurora from Sleeping Beauty. And this is like one of those magic clip dresses. So that's probably why it's in better shape because those don't break as easily or get yucky as easily. So that one's cool. Again, could end up in the giveaway, I don't know. And then we have a one-legged Polly Pocket. So that one's probably just going to get tossed. Unless one of you really wants a gimp. Polly Pocket, a one-legged Polly Pocket, if you do, let me know. And then, let's see, we got another Polly Pocket, and the doll's in good shape, but the, uh, the dress definitely isn't in good shape, and it comes with a little, like, cape that's in good shape, so maybe I'll keep that. And it comes with one boot, but that's, you know, I doubt I'll keep that since I don't have the matching boot. And it also comes with a little... Broken My Little Pony eraser, as you can see, her front uh, hoof is broken, and I probably will throw this away because I don't really want to keep a half-broken eraser or give that away. So that bag, eh, not that great. I didn't find that much in it that is good. Some of the dolls are in good shape, and this one's really pretty good, but the others, eh, not worth quite so much. And So I don't know. I'll do something with them, but... That's uh, some of the stuff that I got at my most recent shopping haul, and I appreciate you guys watching this. I do want to tell you all that um, I did start my own Patreon page to help fund activities I do for this channel, especially the giveaways and like anything that you know I donate to charity or whatever, that kind of stuff, because it does cost money to do the shipping, especially when I do international giveaways. It costs a lot of money. So I'm trying to raise enough to at least do maybe a giveaway a month because I find it fun to give toys away to other people. And if you haven't entered the current giveaway going on, make sure you do so. The link to that will be in the description of this video. I always put the link to the current giveaway in each video. So check that out. And I guess that's it for today. I enjoyed opening this little haul. I think my favorite is definitely the spot. And then after that, it would be the little purple bunny. But it was fun. I enjoy just opening these things. Even if I don't find a lot of stuff that I want to keep, it's fun to go through them. And I guess I'll see you all later. So I hope you all have a great day. So bye!